So here at the at Orleans Avenue Canal, this is my favorite example. So here we have, we have a levee and we have a flood wall. But this flood, and then, uh, so what happens here, this is a pump house, we're pumping water, drain in New Orleans, and the water flows down Orleans Canal out to Pontchartrain through gravity. It's sea level out there, so gravity pulls the water down, so we help uh, empty out the city. But um, this is a great example where all, you see, you know, miles of this elevated extra height, so extra capacity in terms of water in this canal, and it just stops right here. Um, so here you see a sheet piling, this is how we build these, this is how we build uh, levees here. And uh, this is, this lip here is lipped into another piece and it goes on and on and on. So we have, we have steel going straight down into the sediment. In this case, this, uh, the, the, the levee that's here, the flood wall was not continued. Because down over there, we have our pump house also connected to a sewage, uh, our sewage infrastructure. People were worried that if this failed and it ripped out the wall, you'd have uh, poop in your water. So as a consequence, this part of the flood protection system was never completed. And so when Katrina happened, actually this segment right here, water, uh, water flowed out of this when, uh, when the storm was passing until the storm passed and the water level dropped. So this area all flooded, but not because of a, of a levee failure, because of a lack of completion of this key link in this chain that was supposedly going to prevent the flooding of this part of the city of New Orleans.